Hi, it's Gene, retired in Mexico. And if you're new to the channel, we ask one question here, which is, do they write them and sing them like they used to? A lot of people, a lot of people, a lot of people, young, old, doesn't matter. They think the old music is better and they tell me all the time, but I am not so sure. And today we're going to do something uh, from one of our subscribers. Okay, Thomas Houghton sent me uh, a message on my Facebook page. And uh, he's got a band. And this is their, uh, I think this is their second recording. I think they did an EP. And I've read some interesting things about it, like, uh, what, like avant-garde lounge music or various kinds of variations of indie rock and different things. I don't know what to expect. Uh, the band looks um, uh, a little bit, uh, shall we say, peculiar on here they're dressed in some interesting clothing the uh, hand that did the deed so i told him if i didn't like it i wouldn't upload it but um if i like it and you're watching it it'll it'll mean i thought it was pretty cool so yeah you know i uh let's go ahead and watch this um if you like what i'm doing hit that like or subscribe button you know senior reacting to the newer music instead of the usual model of a young person doing classic rock from before they were born we're doing this the other way around and uh i also have a patreon page below so there's uh different ways to support the channel and if you watch my original content uh that helps the channel too because most of what i do is copyrighted material i don't uh usually i make zero my most popular video i've made zero dollars and zero cents so I appreciate your help. Here, here we go. And I couldn't find the lyrics or a band membership, so I don't know what instrument he plays or which one he is. I have no idea, and I, uh, there's no lyrics online. They are a, a fledgling, up-and-coming band. Gotten some good press from a couple people. Let's check it out. Through a liminal space I slip, lift the squib to let the white light in. In the season of despair, we'll dress as wolves and hit the county fair. One minute in the boiler room, locked in the excessive machine. There's not enough space to hide. In space, no one hears you scream. And when they catcheth me, there will be bloody murder. They'll point and prod and say, he almost got away. The head that thought the deed, the eye that saw the deed. The tongue that spoke the deed The heart that drove the deed Of this the hand that did the deed The hand that did the deed The hand that did the deed It was the hand that did the deed I am now valueless, toxic to my community Is this an orgasm? Is this an assassination? Is this true love or general due diligence? Keep your thoughts to yourself Polish up another miniature We'll dress as wolves and hit the county fair On all fours and ambush the villagers
Okay, I like it. Let's hope it, I don't get an ad here. That's funny as hell. Those angular guitars. <laughs> you know, it reminded me, we've done uh, reactions, and I'm not saying they, they sound like these people, but it's just like in the wheelhouse, we've done a couple videos of everything, everything, and there's some uh, commonalities there. And these guys have a real Britishness that I like too. You know, uh, to me, the the most British sounding artist of all time had to be Ian Dury. And I love Ian Dury and Ian Dury and the Blockheads and all the stuff that he did, Hit Me With Your Rhythm Stick and all that. And, uh, but of course, that's very cockney and this is not that way. So that's why I was thinking more of everything, everything. We did um, some, uh, what's his name, Hamish... Hawk? Hawish Hawk? I probably butchered his name. I think he's from England. We did that song about tennis, you know, where the guy got, he got hit with a tennis ball. <laughs> he was bleeding and all these things. And so it kind of reminds me of, of that kind of thing in that wheelhouse. Um, there's another artist we did recently with the really angular guitars that I just love, but can't remember what it was and uh yeah i love that it was funny um it was funny um yeah i mean there might have been just a touch of repetition uh, it, that chorus maybe it hit maybe it hit one time too many but i loved everything else about this and the color coordination i hope those guys all got to wear their color the one that fits their personality the yellow and the pink and the and the turquoise and loved all uh, loved the co color coordination of this but you saw me laughing yeah i'm laughing at this and yet it had a real kind of punk energy to it didn't it i mean it hit it hit hard even the even though the guy in the video just had a little um you know single snare that he was hitting you know not in the recording these guys were hitting the drums hard yeah, good rhythm section. I liked it. What am I going to rate it? A minus, I think. I mean, it was funny as hell, and I enjoyed it. So good stuff. I wish I wish you luck, Thomas. Um, yeah, yeah. I just you know when people say we we hit up my uh, music, I'm like eh, you know. But this was great, and it's well recorded, and it's professional uh the, yeah the video's hilarious that's it you know i loved it so let me know what you guys think uh be kind though because it's a subscriber so be diplomatic if you didn't like it be diplomatic be kind uh and that's it as we say here in boni in mexico buen dia